Hello. Let's talk today about cardinal, ordinal, and nominal numbers. Let's focus on suffixes to form numbers from the other numbers. Most of you probably remember what numbers are. But just to quickly review, let's look at the following. Cardinal number. How many? Ordinal number. Position. Nominal number. Name. A cardinal number is a number that says how many of something there are, such as 1, 2, 3, 4, or 5. It answers the question, how many? Here are five coins. Cardinal is for counting. An ordinal number is a number that tells the position of something in a list or the rank of something. You also use them for dates. It answers the question, which? In this picture, the girl is second, and the two pups are third and fourth. Ordinal says what order things are in. A nominal number is a number used only as a name or to identify something, not as an actual value or position. Example. The number on the back of a footballer, 10. A postal code, 91210. A modal number, 380. Nominal is a name. Cardinal numbers refer to the size of a group. Like, I am 12 years old, or I have four friends. Ordinal numbers refer to a position in a series. Like, my first friend is Anne. It's her 10th birthday today. And nominal numbers refer to a name. Like in, my postal code is 65039. Example. In this photo, there are six cars. Car number 99, with a yellow roof, is currently in the first position. Six is a cardinal number. It tells how many. First is an ordinal number. It tells the position. 99 is a nominal number. It is basically just a name for the car. Most of you have already heard about the suffixes to form numbers from the other numbers. What you notice is that only first, second and third ordinal numbers sound different from the others, right? Any ordinal number that doesn't end in st R, D, or N, D, as in first, second, or third, ends in TH. So, let's go through them together. Suffix TH образует порядковые числительные от количественных, кроме first, second, third. Например, for, fourth. Five, fifth, six, sixth, и так далее. Well, that was easy. The next suffix to form the numbers from 13 to 19 is teen. Look at the examples. Suffix teen образует числительные от 13 до 19 от соответствующих числительных первого десятка. Например, 
three, thirteen, four, fourteen, five, fifteen, six, sixteen, seven, seventeen, eight, eighteen, nine, nineteen. And finally, we move on to the number building suffix ty. Listen, read, and repeat the examples. Pay attention to spelling. Suffix ty образует десятки от числительных первого десятка. Например, two, twenty, three. Thirty, four, forty, five, fifty, six, sixty, seven, seventy, eight, eighty, nine, ninety. That's all for today. We've discussed the noun-forming suffixes. Goodbye for now and good luck!